All right, what's going on, guys? My name is Matt, I'm Sports Talk. And today, I just got my package here from, uh, whatchamacallit, from GameStop. Uh, I ordered a new Xbox so I can give away my old one for you guys. I got the new Slim here, so we're just gonna do a quick unboxing of it. Figured you guys might wanna see this, and this this is not working. Everybody's like in the last video where I did an unboxing for Marvel for 3, I used a pen, they're like, use a, use a blade or a box cutter, be a man. I'm like, meh, whatevs. Use my scissors here. Boom. Now that's done. Hopefully you guys can see this whole thing pretty well. Got some uh, packaging. There we go. <laughs> that's the best part of the whole unboxing, just popping the airbags. Alright, here we go. We got my shipping receipt, a bunch of good stuff, a turning label. Very nice. Don't need that shit. And here we go. I got the, actually I got the holiday bundle is what they call it. As you can see right there, uh, holiday bundle. Basically, it's a 250 gigabyte Xbox. I wanted to get 4 gig, but 4 gig is just not enough for what the kind of stuff I do. So I figured I'd get the 250 gig. There's no in between, which kind of sucks. I think they should really have some kind of in between hard drive, like 100 gig, that'd be perfect because I don't need 250, but 4 is not enough. Anyway, um, 300 bucks is the normal price for just the Xbox for 250 gig. They have a holiday bundle where you get Halo Reach downloadable content. It's the game. Full game download. There you go. Halo Reach. I won't be playing that, but if you guys want it, I'll give that away probably. And I can also get the uh, Fable 3 game, which I also probably won't play because I don't play these kind of games. Uh, so if you guys want that, let me know in the comments. I'll, I'll definitely uh, give it away in one of the comments. Just leave a comment if you guys want it. And I'll give that away. Uh, you don't have to like or favorite the video. Just leave a comment and I'll pick someone. So the two free games there. It also comes with a three-month membership of uh, Xbox Live Gold, which is sweet. I already have my 12-month or a year one, but that's an extra three months for free, pretty much. And I also got a $60 GameStop gift card with this, all for $300. So technically, I got, you know, probably $720, probably the probably $30 each now, so I probably got like $120 worth, including the GameStop gift card, plus this, probably $80 worth of free stuff with the holiday bundle versus just buying the regular thing. That's the power of basically going online and looking up the special deals they have, just so you guys know. This is a cool deal they have right now, only for the holiday bundle, so that's definitely uh, something you guys should look into if you're going to get a new Xbox. Or... You can, I don't know if you can see it here, let me just lift this up a little bit, you can probably see it now. That Xbox right there, giving that away, you can go see the sister commentary for that though. So let's continue this here. Let's actually open up the actual Xbox casing. I know, I'm not the best at unboxing guys, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm not perfect. It should come with a controller, I actually broke my other controller, I can find it here. Here it is. Look at this thing. Look at this analog stick. It's a retard. I broke it. Uh, I broke it with the control freak. I actually I twisted the control freak on with to get the control freak to stay on better. Look at that. And it broke. Jump in. I'm jumping in. Just kidding. That was gay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not perfect. Alright, so first off we got, um, this is your mic here. I actually already have one, the same exact one. I just bought it for 10 bucks on eBay. What a waste of money that was, because now I got another one, so maybe I'll give that away too if you guys need a mic. Or maybe I'll just keep it just in case I break one when I rage. Uh, what's next here? Next we got, oh, my controller. Let's see this bad boy. This is actually kind of important to me. Let me just over here for a sec. Alright, oh, nice black. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Matches the actual Xbox. That's different, look at that. On the old Xbox Elite, or Pro or whatever, yeah, the Elite, they had gray uh, thumbsticks and D-pad. This is really nice. Got the gloss in here too. Glossy. That's really nice. Nice black one. There's that. And then uh, what else we got in here? Oh, we got. Oh, here's the here's the battery. They even give you two Duracell batteries. That's nice. How kind of them. You know, I'm, I really wanted those. I made my day. Here's stable three. You want it? Leave a comment. It's all yours. I will leave it in the wrapper too because I don't play this game. And then we got a bunch of stuff over here. Why am I speaking like an Indian? I'm not racist or stereotypical or judgmental. Ugh, I can't get it all out quick enough. That's what she said. Oh, God. There's the downloadable content for Halo Reach. Blah, 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 blah. I actually had to scratch this off anyway. So there's that. We got all this goodness. Halo Reach something or other. Here's my uh, three. Look at that. $25 value. That's great. Three months of Xbox Gold. Great. Loving that. 
and then uh, some more flyers for something I don't give a shit about. And then let's get the actual bad boy out of here. Oh crap. Let's get this out of here. Oh, we got more. We got the, the smaller looking um, AC adapter. What is this? Whoa, I should be careful with this. Oh, this is the new power strip. Wow, that's a lot smaller. Look at that. A lot smaller than the other one. Uh, you got your component cables. I hope this is the same as the other one. I have to buy a new one. You got your component cables right here. Video. Not high, not high def, I don't think. And then, here's the actual Xbox. I gotta be careful with this bad boy. Move this stuff out of the way. And here is the bad boy. They actually put in foam. How nice of them. I guess we'll unwrap it for you lovely people. We'll stand it up. Leave a comment below. I want to know this, guys. I've always wanted to know why people do these things. But do you leave yours like this? When you, when you play, do you have it horizontally sitting? Or do you have it standing up? Let me know. I want to know what you guys have. Because I think it's just it's funny to see how people have different things. And I don't understand why you would have it one way versus the other. But I keep mine laying down. I feel like standing up, uh, when you put the disc up wrong way, this is the backwards part of it. Got the grill there. There's the Xbox part of it. And then it's the grill over here. And then that's another grill there. So that's that. I always have it like this because I feel like, you know, Xbox 360 and then it just slides out because gravity, you put the disc down and the gravity pulls back in. But if you have it like this and you put it inside, I feel like it'll fall out before it falls back in and holding a break. But that doesn't happen, obviously. So let me know what you guys have. Do you guys have it upright or have it side laying down? I like laying down because of the gravity thing. And I also like that uh, if I feel like I have it, if I was standing up like this, that, you know, if, if I actually like, hit it with like a ball or playing with it or something, it'll fall over and break. But um, that's all for now, guys. Please be sure to leave a comment um, for the games. Let me get them back over here for a second. Uh, the Halo. The Halo. If you want one of these games, leave a comment. Hopefully you can see them. And um, winner, we'll, you, guys, you guys can win one of those. And then also uh, leave me a rating, please, what you guys think. And I'll see you all next time. Peace.